The season is changing, and with that comes the time for transitional wines. We still don't know if during the day is still hot, and at night you might want to put on more than just a jacket. As there is different types of clothes for the year, the same happens with wine. You can hold off on the heavy reds and mold spice wines for now, but you might want to switch up your summer Pinot Grigios and Sauvignon Blancs to some cooler weather wines. Hello, I'm David and I'm here with winemaker Oscar from Santa Rita Estates outside Santiago, Chile. Right now, we're gonna talk about red wines that pair best with my favorite season, fall. Oscar, thank you for being with us today. I love fall, mostly because it's not quite hot enough for summer. It's just starting to get crisp. What would some of the best red wines be for this uh, cool time of year? You know, we have here three choices of, of wine, very good for uh, autumn uh, before winter. And one of the choices is uh, Pinot Noir from Carmen. It's called Wave Series. It's a harvest uh, 2017. And this is a, a great wine for uh, fall because uh, the wine is fresh. It actually has to be drunk, you know, very fresh. Uh, at really low temperature because um, um, this is a, a red wine, but it feels like a white in terms of the expression, the full expression of the fruit. The, the mouthfeel and the palate of this wine is so far from the Cabernet Sauvignon and very soft in the palate. Huh? So if you put it in, uh, on the fridge and then you drink it with, you know, strawberries or any fruit, you know, any salad, it's, it's awesome. It's a nice color. But in the nose, you can feel, you know, that fruit expression. Yeah, it smells fantastic. This is called, you know, the, the white of the reds. Because you drink it cooler, because it's softer. Right, and being cool is not a characteristic normally thought of when we think of red wines. When you also think of pairing uh, with food, um, in the case of Pinot Noir, you can absolutely change and go towards a different side. You can drink it by itself, cool, in the morning or during the day, anytime, you can drink it, you know, with appetizers like we have here, you know, fruits, and it will go perfectly with any of those. Very versatile. And so could you tell us a little bit more about uh, some of the other options here that we have on the table? We have a uh, Merlot and a uh, Malbec. Well, first, uh, this is a uh, Merlot 2017. In this case, the Merlot is uh, a typical an ancient wine varietal. It has a, a big fruit expression, some flowers, you know, in the nose, violets. So they fill the palate. They, the, 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 you, you have mouth feel, you know, um, juiciness, but not the, the, the harshness of the, mm -hmm. of the tannins. In fact, when you drink the wines uh, cool, fresh, the fruit expression comes out uh, much better than uh, when you drink it warmer. Merlot is in between, you know, whites and reds also, not as the Pinot Noir that we just tasted. I love it. It's a very full flavored red wine. It's fantastic. And this wine, um, you know, the color intensity is higher, but you see how soft it is in the palate. Huh? Usually has uh, like ruby red color, but with violet notes. And that's typical on the Merlot. So the last wine um, is um, Malbec 2016 from uh, Doña Paula Estate. It is uh, sweet, it's soft, the tannins are rounded, very juicy, very easy drinking wine. It's not too harsh, it's not too sweet. It's just right in the middle, it's right perfect. And you can feel in this Malbec, you know, all that fruit coming from the grapes. Um, probably if it had uh, some oak, you cannot no notice it. Basically, it's the fruit coming forward. That's very important on an elegant and fresh wine for fall. Another fantastic red wine. I feel much more prepared for, for fall now, or autumn. Thank you for having us today. Thank you for sharing your knowledge about red wine. Hopefully, we can do it again with some other wines on a different season. Salud. So